the Fiesta Bowl. January 1st, 2019, 12 p.m. in Glendale, Arizona. It's on ESPN. Central Florida, UCF, 12-0, 9-3 against the spread, 3-1 against the spread in their last four. And LSU, 9-3, 6-6 against the spread, 1-3 in their last four. Line opened up LSU minus 8, and the, uh, the total was 54.5. That is now up to 55.5, and, and the line has come down to 7.5. What what's your the metrics by the way have got UCF favored? They should, they should be. I think the line is off, and it's, this it's, is it's point two eight and sixty seven is the point total on this, which is way over the fifty five. This is Power Five football bias. That's all this is, and I've I've been saying it forever. Th- this team is really good. I'm the one guy that defended them, and now my team has to play them. And that's what pisses me off. That's what makes me mad. It's, I'm the one defending you guys. What's my reward? No, no. Florida gets to coward their way out of this game. And LSU gets stuck with them. I think I think UCF's going to win the game. I think they're the better team. Is is Greedy Williams playing in this game? No. No. All right, and nor so should he. Uh, we know Mackenzie Milton is not playing. I uh, Let me tell you. I like LSU in the spot. I think they're going to be fired up for this game. I I don't know. I, I know, don't know offensively how we score with them. I think you will be able to run the football like it is going out of style. We might be able to. You're probably right on that. Memphis ran on them. We can run on them. But I, we in, have in to, the at some trenches, point in time, we have to be able to stop them. And, and I think you'll be able to do that. Because Dave Aranda against a freshman quarterback, like, he he has one game, or no, is it two games that he started against UConn early in the year? But it, he's got two games of starting experience against awful defenses. Correct. He has never seen anything like what he is going to see in this game. Like even I hope if LSU you're right. plays backups, I, I hope you're right. So I like LSU here a lot. Like I'm I'm a I think LSU absolutely okay. handles these dudes. Um. And that's not to say that like UCF doesn't belong in the game or anything like that. I think it would have been a much closer game with McKenzie Milton, but I like the matchup of Dave Aranda against uh, against Mac a lot because I think that he will confuse this kid. They will get picks. They will get turnovers. Um, I hope you're right. Yeah, if both of LSU's cornerbacks are going to be out. I don't think it matters. They got players back there. They are they are stacked. They are loaded. Um, how do you? I'm I'm gonna go over. Oh the 55 yeah. And a half. No, the over is definitely the play. That seems really low. Yeah. Like why? It, you think? I mean, because it's so funny looking. You think maybe something's there? I don't. I don't know the answer to that. I mean, the only thing I can think of is Vegas thinks LSU is going to win twenty eight to nothing. Like I can't. I can't figure out why the number is so low unless you think UCF just won't score on this defense. And I think they'll be able to put up some points, but I think LSU can put up a lot. And I I mean, again, I could be wrong. But this defense is not look I mean, this offense has not looked great. No, they haven't. They haven't. But I, I think they can in this spot. I think they really can. 